Hi, lovely. How can I help you? You've got an appointment. Okay. And what name was that under? Okay. There you are. You're actually with me. Yes, I'm going to be your makeup. Okay, of course. And for your eyes, what colours are you thinking? Mm. Yes, I do. I think that would work really well with your, your eye colour. Okay, great. And would you like false lashes at all? Mm -hmm. Okay. No trouble. Now... Um, skincare, have you used anything on your skin today? You haven't? Okay. Well, I will start just by taking a cotton um, round and some cleanser and just wiping your face over, okay? Fabulous. Okay. So I've got my cotton round here and you just that on the top of the cleanser and I'm just going to hold this like so and just wipe your face okay okay making sure we go down your I'm going to take another one and again Fantastic, you can open your eyes now. Thank you. Um, I think I'm going to use a little bit of moisturiser. So I just have this moisturiser here, um, fragrance free, so you don't have to worry about that. Okay, so I'm just going to set it down and just pump from the top. Probably three pumps. my fingers and brush that over your face and also getting your neck there as well I'm going to use um, two serums mixed together as well. I'm going to use some hyaluronic acid and some niacinamide as well. Mm -hmm. So I'm just going to take some on the bed and just pop a few drops on the side on your face. Excuse me. And then this is the niacinamide. Just need a little bit more, excuse me. Great, and now we'll rub that in as well.
Are you going alone um, to your event or do you have some, somebody accompanying you? Okay. Great. We'll just leave that to dry for a moment. Just with your skin type, do you think you have dry, combination, oily? A bit oily, okay. Yes, no, so if you're going to an event that's going to be, you know, going into the, the early hours of the morning, I probably would recommend a pore minimising primer, so it will just smooth out your face. So it um, comes in a little tube, just screw the end off and just put that back on without losing any product that we've got here. Again, just rub into the ends of my fingers. Give you this little mirror here. I'll bring it a little bit closer so you can see where. Yeah, so it's just smoothed out your pores. Okay. Now, foundation. Do you prefer a more liquidy foundation, like a more foamy mousse type foundation? Something lightweight. Okay. Well, your skin is. Your skin is in very nice condition really, you don't really have any um, blemishes or redness. Yes, so I think, da, 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 da. I think we'll use this one, but I just need to try and colour match. If you could give me your wrist, I'm just going to pop a small amount of product. last two colours that I put on your wrist, yeah. You agree? Okay, fantastic. So we'll take and this one. And just with a um, Q-tip, I'm just going to mix those together. So it looks like this, this colour. <laughs> Fantastic. Right. I'm just going to apply that to your face with this brush. Yeah, I definitely prefer a brush over a sponge.
your head up a little bit for me. Thank you. I'm just going to candy your neck. so I can get your ears thank you and the other ear good okay just get a wipe take that off my hand um, now we'll use a small amount of concealer under your eye Yes, and then we'll use a setting powder underneath as well. Okay. Mm. Not that one. Where is the one I'm looking for? Here it is. gonna pop a little bit on your chin as well. Great. Um, where's my other brush? Okay. So I'm just gonna One thing I do use Beauty Blend for is the finishing powder, or the setting powder. Yes. So... You have to be very careful with this, because it is a little bit messy. So I'm just going to take the Beauty Blender, just dab that in, and do a few look up for me so I can get really into the crease under your eye. Thank you. Excuse me, I'm just going to have a sip of my drink. Just a little bit thirsty. Okay, so contour wise, do you like a bold contour or do you like a more natural looking? Okay, so sort of in the middle. Of course. Well, I have palette here which has the bronze the highlight and the blush mm, yeah so if you pass me your wrist that's you happy with that okay good good what I'll do is I'll start with the bronze and I'll apply it just above so if you were to just above the indent of your cheek. I'll also apply it around your chin here as well, a little bit on the sides of your neck so it does blend your neck, so you do only have one side of your neck, excuse me, and around your forehead as well. Of course I can contour your nose, yeah, I'll contour your nose a little bit as well. Mm -hmm. Is there a specific part of your nose that you're not happy with? So you just want it to, you know, 
Okay, the narrowing. Yeah, of course, that's fine. Well, I'll take this brush. And if you can smile for me. Yeah, mouth shut. Thank you, I'll start with contouring your cheek here. And as I do it, I will bring it up just to your temples here as well. You can rest your face for a moment <laughs> and smile again. Thank you. Okay, you can stop smiling now. Bring that around your forehead. Okay. Um, if you again, just lift your head up for me slightly. Under, yeah, I just want to get under your chin. Thank you. Good. So well for me. And just down your neck here a little bit as well. Just down the sides and bring that down your chin. So you don't have a cut off if you pop your head back for me. Thank you, sweetheart. Okay. I do need a finer tip brush just for contouring your nose. So if you stay still for me, thank you. what I'll do for you as well is I'll just pop a little bit on the tip of your nose as well. So I'm just going to stick a little bit on the tip of your nose, tip of your nose right there. Okay, perfect. Great. Um, I'll do the blush for you next, then we'll put the highlight up top. Mm -hmm. Okay. Do you like a Again, same with the bronze. How do you like your blush? Do you like it more prominent or pronounced or more of a neutral blush? Okay. Yes. And you want a little bit of blush on the end of your nose. Okay, of course. So this is my blush brush. I'll just pop it in the one at the end here. And if you smile again for me. I'm just gonna going to pat 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 pat. Because we don't want much of that as you said. Okay. Just then a little bit on the end of your nose, okay. Super. Okay. Right, let's do the highlight. Ah, got my stuff all over the place. I'm sorry, I'm a little bit messy. <laughs> okay, again, so middle one, we got the highlight. Yeah, it's more like a champagne colour. <laughs> and for the final time, if you can smile for me, I'm just going to pop this at the very tips of your cheek. Close that and put that down. Okay, let's move on to your eyes. Maybe I think I might do your eyebrows first actually. What would you like me to do with your eyebrows? So you like a really natural brow. <laughs> you have got quite thick, in a nice way, you have really nice thick eyebrows that naturally 
have like a really lovely arch to them. Okay, so if we use a little bit of um, like a brow soap just to pop them in place, and then if there's any sparse areas and possibly the tail as well, we could just fill that in. Okay, so the brow soap I use um, comes like this. It's in a little palette in itself and it's got the little brush here that we can use. Okay, so we'll just take the... Okay. those to set for a moment but with your eyebrows Um, I was probably thinking we could, let me just readjust my hand, sorry, so we could use this one, mm -hmm. so we could use that one on the inner corner, okay, and you think this one, okay, so we'll use this one on the entire lid, okay, this one we could do here, in the outer corner and then this one we could bring into the crease that's good yep, no we're on the same wavelength <laughs> right let me just fill in those sparser areas of your eyebrow with how everything looks so far. Mm. Okay. Good. Right. Let's get my makeup, my, my eyeshadow brush and the palette here. And we'll take this one and close your eyes for me. Thank you. use this one for the outer corner
just drag that in so we've got a good blend excuse me okay yeah that's good and then we'll do the inner crease I'm going to use a different brush for this one I'm going to use this brush, it's just a bit of a finer tip. Okay. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Good. We're done with the eyeshadow. Would you like eyeliner? Okay, liquid or pencil? Liquid, okay. Now, do you like a dramatic? Okay, so thin and a small wing, okay. You have a picture? Yeah, show me. Yes. Okay. Of course, yeah, I can do that. Alright. Well, I'm just gonna need to hold your the side of your face and pull on, on your temple slightly just so it pulls the skin. Okay, so I'm gonna start with this eye and I'm just gonna pull the skin here, okay? And start with the wing here. I'm just going to, again, pull the skin there and just... Just fill in. Okay, that looks good. Really good, yeah. Okay. Right, and again, just going to hold the skin on your temple and... We'll let that dry. Don't touch it. No, don't touch. And if you just have a look, is that that's long enough? Okay, good. And the eye as well. Superb. Okay. Right. Now lashes. What sort of false lashes do you like? Do you like them to be have body throughout? Do you like them to have body just at the outer? corners mostly. It depends what sort of eye shape you're wanting. Okay, so you like them where they're fuller at the outer edges. That more seductive look. <laughs> yes, I know what you mean. I think it's called a fox eye, I think. Uh, da -da 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 -da. Well, I have these. Yes, yeah, so these have the, the fuller at the end. You're happy with these ones? Okay, that's perfect. I'm just going to open that up. Get my tweezers. And let's pop those down for a second. And the glue. Okay, set them there. So I apply the glue to the lash. to take them with my tweezers yes and just carefully place those on okay now I'm just gonna use the tweezers and press them down so they stick okay yes. 
Alright. And the other pair. Other pair, the other lash, sorry. Just going to put the glue on. Okay, let's just let that dry. Now, with a lip colour, you've put your own lipstick. Okay, don't need to bother you with showing you mine then. Um, I am just going to pop a little bit of mascara on the, um, inner corners of the lashes that we've put on and just throughout um, and a little bit on your bottom lashes as well are you happy with that? you are? okay okay so keep your eyes open for me Again, I'll just let that dry. Would you be able to get the lip colour that you're wanting? Thank you. Okay. Ooh, stunning. Very nice. Because it's your colour, I assume you're happy for me to apply the stick directly to your Yes, so normally I'd use a brush. Okay. Okay, so don't pout. If you just leave your mouth relaxed, so we all look like this. Okay. Thank you. And then if you do me a favour and rub your lips together for me. Okay. And then if you can open your mouth, I need to get the sides. Thank you. give you this bit of tissue, just fold it over, just pop it between your lips. Good. Let's pop that in a bit. Right, just before I put the finishing spray on, is there anything that you would like to change? Okay, good. Fantastic. Well, just give it a little bit of a shake before we use it. Now, close your eyes for me. Let's let that set. Would you mind?
mind if I took a couple of photos of you? Yes. Thank you. Okay. So if you just look straight at me. Thank you. Like if you just look back there for me. Thank you. Then still just look back there for me. Okay, if you could look up. I am going to bring the phone up a little bit a bit if you, if you can still look up for me. Okay. That's great. Well, you've been a pleasure to look after and I hope your evening goes really well. Thank you. Yes, if you want to just go to the desk there, they can um, take payment from you. You already paid the deposit, right? Okay. Yes, it'll just be the remainder. Fantastic. Take care. Have a great evening and I hope I can work with you in the future.